Give me him much, Jimmy.
Right, does it work now? Ah! Ah ha ha ha! Right. Why was... Why did my stream do that? Why did that turn that off? That's very strange. Right, Bonga, thank you for that comment. Can't hear your mic. That's that... Can you hear me now? Oh, hello, Aiden. How you doing? Is in the lead. Was that a British flag on your mug? It definitely was. It's got a, a big mug for big British uh, British tea. Mm-mm. Sanity. What is this game? This game is Battlefield 1. Right, hopefully... There we go. Ah, nice one. I don't know why. So, sometimes, I think it's when I do an update to my PC, it removes the actual mic uh, setting. I don't know why it does it. It is annoying every time it does. I oh, got him. There's usually somebody there, so we'll drop a mine. Thank you, Bonga. You saved you saved the day there. Oh, that's an AT gun to the face. Yeah, we go. We can. Nice one. How are you doing? I'm doing fine, thank you, Sandy. See how are you doing? So, what do you uh, do on this game? I love this. I love the graphics. It's an old. It's an older uh, game, to be honest. I think it came in uh, 2016. Um. Our side is in the lead. So what are you doing in the game? So it's basically it's set in World War One. Uh, so you fight at the minute we're playing just classic team deathmatch. So it's twelve. It's uh, I think it's twenty four players uh, all together. It's basically like a Call of Duty, but with more team based aspects. If you know what I mean. Gonna lob that there. Okay, we missed everybody. Our side is in the lead. I, I, oh, okay, got sniped. There we go. Nice one, Aiden. How you doing today, Aiden? Are you alright? On a chunk, got two. Actually, look, the stairs, aren't they? The Love a grenade up there. I hear people's footsteps. I hear someone got bayonet charged. Here, pressure money, John. Throw that down. Oh, hello. He didn't look behind him at all. I didn't, I, too bad, I didn't even see where he came from. Oh, I ran straight into that one. Halfway there. We need to push harder. The graphics are better than COD Warzone and somehow it's old. Yeah, that's the thing. It's, it's older games it's built a lot better, aren't they? I think Battlefield focuses more on uh, graphics over uh, like Call of Duty. BTW. Oh, by the way, I'm good. I'm good. That's good to hear. It's the first, yeah, it's the first time I'm actually streaming as a shore and a normal, uh, or what do you call it, a horizontal and vertical live stream. So you do want to see actually how well they both work out. Because apparently I can double stream, I can do this. This is, this is, this is loud. If it's loud, I'm going to do it. 
There's definitely some people upstairs in there. Oh, more people upstairs. Is there a version on mobile? No, it's uh, a lot older than that. If you got uh, do you, uh, what, do you have an Xbox or PC or anything like that? If you have an Xbox, PC or PlayStation, you can be able to play on them. And they, it's pretty cheap. I think it's only like £16 now. <laughs> oh, mine. Oh, I'm gonna chuck that there. Catch. Yes. I love the limpets. This it's not as arcadey as Battlefield. Uh, when you're playing Team Deathmatch, you can basically do what you want. But when you play, if you play on the bigger maps like Conquest, this is basically a huge map where you gotta like sort of work together to actually take the objectives and stuff. Throw that. Throw that over there. Nice. Oh, that's some dynamite out the window. I've got a piece of it. It's not with me currently. Yeah, you're able to get on. Uh, if you go to EA, you're able to get it on there. I think I'm pretty sure on EA it's, it's literally only 16 pounds as well. If you actually, if you go and have a look on CD keys, you might be able to pick the game up a little bit cheaper as well. Steam guy, do you play PC, Xbox, or PC? I'm playing on PC at the minute. I do have an Xbox, but it's been a long time since I played Xbox on uh, this game. And it's uh, not this game isn't crossplay either. Oh no no I'm turning I'm turning around from that. I see all the boys on top of the roof there. Yeah, we'll take that. Oh no, say there, medic. Nope. He bailed on that. Sometimes you can revive your teammates if they've got a syringe and they're a medic. Yes, Monichon. I have a feeling somebody's up there. Ooh, you bugger. Giant Shadow. Giant Shadow is not a bad map. Sanity. I've got, uh, yo, I've got to go for now. Uh, be right back, uh, depending on how long you stream. Oh, no worries. Uh, no worries, Sanity. Nice for popping by, mate. Not bad, actually. Oh, top of the leaderboard. I'm trying to see how it looks like actually on the stream, because obviously it's a bit weird. I might actually. I wonder if I could turn on the phone sideways. Do you lot? Do you lot when you watch streams? Uh, sorry, streams on.
Ooh, my, my dad just gave me a puzzle box. And now I'm intrigued to find out how to get inside it. Probably something like that. The enemies have oh, first. I slid something. Okay. I've slid this piece out of the puzzle box. You're going to end the stream. Uh, no, I ain't going to end the stream. I should be on for quite a while, actually. Oh. The enemy is in okay. the lead. Okay. Okay. So I've got the key out of the box now. And now, where do I put the key? All that panel's loose. Do we go the opposite way? Oh, that's bloody... Ah, that's bloody tight. Okay, got that bit off. Ah, there we go. <laughs> There's no beginner. My dad's gave me an empty puddle box. That's pretty cool, actually. That goes in there. That slides up like that. And that goes in there. Oh, no, want it. Oh, I thought it's all falling to pieces. I broke it. <laughs> oh, it's so tight. Ugh. Oh, put it on. I'll put it on the wrong, wrong way now. Uh oh. And that go. Ah, the key then goes in there. I've just solved a puzzle box in what less than a couple of minutes. Less than two minutes. There we go. Okay, I'm going to try and play it on a match on CODM. I think that's COD. And come back. Nice one. No worries, uh, Sanity. Bravo. Bravo. I have just heard someone running in a, this building. Oh, no, catch that, catch that. Nice. Oh. Yeah, so I might actually change you lots on the uh, short live stream. I might change you to the side so you can actually see probably more of the game. But then are oh, people going to want to flip this phone to the side? Reload. There's definitely somebody up there. I do love that big bomb. Oh, he wasn't even shooting at me. He got the, he got me instead of the other bloke. We go around, I think. Oh, 
Oh, camping little git. I'm strung into that one. <laughs> little piggy. I'm just trying to have a look, see how the stream thing works. It's got you. That's weird. That is. It's really weird how they set that up. So obviously, I've not got the whole thing worked out then. The enemies have almost won. I never fully do. Okay, that's weird. I'm just trying to work out how that actual stream works. I said I might, I might, I might try and flip it sideways or something. Oh, the chat's gonna be out. I'll just, I'll just play with it. Oh no! But he made it behind me. The British uh, medics are supposed to be the Indian troops, right? Yeah, I think they're supposed. To. Yeah, they're supposed to be like Indian or Sikh, aren't they? I think they're supposed to be like Commonwealth, aren't they? Actually, I just realised I've got my mouse next to me still. Why are you going to throw my aim off? I think all of them, because aren't the, aren't the snipers... Uh, aren't the British snipers supposed to be off uh, the um, Anzac? Australian troops. I think they're supposed to be. So five likes, thank you so much everybody, really appreciate it. The pickle said he was going to be joining and he's not. He's not on. I said he'll get on shortly. And for oof, that's not good. That's not good at all. Yeah, so I'm trying to work out how this works. I think there's some settings obviously are missing somewhere. Yeah, so obviously some settings are missing somewhere. These are going all right though. Let's go sniper now. Actually, I might when I die, I might go shotgun. I, I do like a good old shotgun in. Near that.
Oh, I'm out. I'm out. No. The enemy is in the lead. Feindlicher Sturmsoldat, seid vorsichtig. Munition. Munition zu mir. Ah, did I miss that one? Ooh. Yeah, probably going to a shotgun. It's probably going to be a better shout. <laughs> that says you like for camping. You should have moved when I played the first grenade. Oh, got him. Do like the shotgun. Okay, you head down, boy. You got a big gun. I can see why they wanted to ban shotguns. Oh, no, the machine guns are better. Actually, it's right down that time from a minute ago. That's quite funny. Right down the time so I can clip them for later. Oh, you bugger. You little bugger. No. I was just slightly above my pay grade. I'm not gonna go. Uh, I'm not even gonna challenge that sniper. Oh, nice, nice grenade. Oh, he must, he must have known I was there. Sir. 
Oh, beautiful. There we go, that got him out. Sometimes when they're camping like that, they just need a little bit of persuasion. Oh, or bayonet. I do feel like they are upstairs. Oh, I see, oh, I see where that sniper is. Oh, we can go around. I'm gonna stab him. Kang, how you doing, mate? Oh, play sniper, I'm spotting me. I'm saying I've. Just worked out, Kang, I can actually stream vertically and horizontally on YouTube. I'm trying out both, see now they work. Ooh. Why is your video format like short? I'm just trying to swing out differently, just seeing actually how... So I'm streaming vertically and horizontally at the minute. Um, I just want to see actually how well it works. Weren't bad actually. That was not bad. Right, be back in a minute. Right, I'm back. The enemies have struck first. Hayden, uh, I, might have, I might have missed it, but was there an issue with the game? What, the game playing today, tonight, or? I, was, I, I know when I started the stream, I had a problem with my uh, sound, uh, my mic. It's, uh, for some reason, now, every now and then OBS resets my mic. Oh, no. Strafe. Strafe. Strafe. Our side is in the lead. Oh, get. Yeah, for, so, so I know for some reason sometimes uh, the game just likes to reset my settings. I don't know why it does it. A 
think it's just another thing that Battlefield likes to do. Just a little bit uh, ago. Technical difficulties. Yeah, it was just the mic. It's, it's say OBS just sort of... Uh, for some reason, it just resets my uh, settings every now and then. I don't know why it does it. it. It just is a thing that it likes to do. Right, split those... Uh... Attenzione, mitragliatrice nemica! Oh, he's trying to bait me like mad. Okay, they might think that dude is spawning me. Might be the per might be me. Oh, now be shot from behind. Attenzione, mitragliatrice! There we go. Oh! Oh, I suck. I suck. Oh, I definitely do suck. Mm, might skip. Yeah, we'll skip. I do like to put grenades or flares like in doorways or something. Like that. If anybody walk, uh, walks out that door now, they're going to get burnt. That's why I've got to throw the grenades down. Grenades, flares. Might actually go down. Screw it. Oh no, that's a shotgun. No, we we're not going to deal with that. Okay, for some reason. Okay, both streams have uh, gone strange. I know it still says I'm still streaming, so. Quite just a strange. Ah, reload is successful. Una mitragliatrice! 
I'm going to slowly peek this. What about I say? If someone's going to someone's going to get him. I think there was a dude behind those rocks over there. This medic is just clearing everybody up. I don't like when you hear bullets fly over my head. We're gonna have you. We've got to have you. Oh, we'll have you as well. As well. Get a good old two for one. Oh, I'm gonna say then follow up with a bayonet charge, and then I got stuck on the wall. Oh, that was okay. I got that was the final kill. That was a good shot. I was going to say, Dad, I opened it up. I think so. And my panel slides, bit comes out, this comes out, two goes in. Our side have struck first. I don't know why I just said I did the same thing. I thought I did stiff. I was like, oh, it's supposed to be like that. Our side is in the lead. The enemy is in the lead. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Pinned? I went 
to an open every time. So I close the door for the dog comes in. There we go. Thank you. Right, I'm back, everyone. That just show me. I did. I did. The, I did do the puzzle box, but apparently I did it wrong. That just show me. Oh, that's a very, very crap spawn. Do you like horror movies? If so, which ones are you top pick? Ooh, horror movies. I do like a good zombie movie. Um, I'm trying to think of any of them on the top of my head at the minute. Um, I'm a bit... What is it? I'm a bit all over the place with horror movies, to be honest. I, I like the, uh, no, like the Korean ones that they do. They're on Netflix. Um, what's the what latest one we watched a while ago? We went Sweet Home. Sweet Home was a good one, though. I think it's All Gone or something like that. Um, that, that, was, that was a good one. I do like that one. Um... A bit all over the place with uh, horror movies, to be honest. I, I just sort of, I sort of watch them, just sort of like see what I think. I'm not a big fan of Saw and Freddy Krueger and Jason and stuff like that. I think that I think they're okay horror movies, but they're not like top, like best, if you know what I mean. I think they're just more better because they're classic. That's first aid for you. Oh, bloody good grenades. Did none of those, I don't think a single grenade I threw then actually hit the target. Oh, that was a big chunk of lag. Big chunk of lag. Yeah, the same with uh, other movies though, uh, Aiden. It's sort of a bit all over the place, really. Sort of, like, I'll watch them and sort of see what I think. I'm trying to think. Any recently I've watched. Got the sights on the side of the gun of this gun. Watch it, boys. I kind of want to go on the roof, but I, I know there's going to be. Take the medical pouch. I know there's going to be crap up there. Oh, I got clubbed. What oh, horror movies do you like, Hayden? Because I probably have watched them with my girlfriend, actually. Oh, actually, what's the... I watched one on on Netflix. Hey, buddy. Hey, oh, you're right, Pickles. Yeah, good. Cheers, dude. Thank you. How are you? Not bad, thank you. I'm uh, just loading up now. Sorry, I'm a bit later than what I meant to start. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, I thought you were busy or something. I know Dave sent me a message saying he's out at the minute. So I thought, ah, fair enough. Shot from the right. Take a medical pouch. Thank you. No, no, no. Good for you bastards. How's your uh, 
Uh, well, apparently it wasn't that at all in the end. It was a viral infection that just caused pain. Because that's now all fine. Let me just turn you up a little bit because... Yeah, everyone keeps saying I'm a bit on the quiet side now. <laughs> yeah. I said I was like really loud the other day, so I turned my mic down. <laughs> <laughs> Freaking balancing it. Mmm. First aid, take it! Yeah, I was saying, I went to the, uh... What was it? I went to the hospital on, I think, last Monday. Yeah. Because I started getting pains in my, uh, uh, uh, they call it flank pains. So pains like my uh, left and right side of the back, which I said was my liver. Is it liver or kidneys? So you know right side of your back, you've got, well, you've you sort of right side of your abdomen and, and your mm. back, you've got your, your liver. Um, and then both left and right side, like mm. just below mid, uh, but technically still lower back, you've got your kidneys. Yeah, I think this. I think it said. I think it said it was a liver or something. No, I can't remember now. I basically said whatever it, the infection obviously went to a water infection yeah. that went up into the kidneys. Yeah, that's or liver, and then right. yeah, it's just unfortunate. I mean, I've I think I've had a few UTIs in the past, and they're not nice. Mm. They can be quite pain to uh, diagnose correctly as well. Yeah. That's, that's what they said. I did a, a urine test and they yeah. said it was there was there was no blood or nothing. No, so I was like, oh, okay, fair enough. Going on then, I'm no. guessing good because that's the main thing, isn't it? Do you yeah. Don't want any sinister shit? No. Going on. Whereas, um, I, I got uh, that's all down below. It, it's just my stomach. Yeah. And my kidneys and stuff like that now that are still a bit tender, but oh, it's it just discomfort, yeah. yeah. It's every day it's getting better. I just get these like waves of sickness every yeah, now and then. Yeah, I can imagine. It's not nice. It's mm. not nice. Yeah, so basically just two weeks off with a load of antibiotics and yeah. stuff, and that's basically with my life like two, yeah. for two weeks. Well, sometimes you just got to have a bit of time off. Mm. Just be helped, you know. Yeah. Let's just come over. Oh, Let's kick over that gun. The enemy is in oh, the actually. lead. We need to unlock the how. Aha! So he are them chances. I'm currently streaming on uh, horizontally and vertically on YouTube. Enemy team is in the lead. I know it's. Ooh, you bugger. Now, whether you want to consider it a horror, it's up to you. Jaws is up there for me. I've, to be honest, I think I've watched Jaws, actually. I, th I think it's just like... With horror movies, I think the older ones just better because of the classical. Um, it's the same thing with uh, like The Exorcist and stuff like that. They're not really scary. They're just sort of like an old style horror. That's the way I look at it, Hayden. And so I don't like. Um, it's a bit. It's a bit weird with horror. It's like I don't mind gory stuff. So I, I think zombies are quite horrifying. I do like the, I do like the zombie movies. 
Which movie are you talking about? Um, Aiden was just talking about horror movies and if I like horror movies. Yeah, I'm not really into horror and horror movies. But, um, mm. I do like the occasion. If it's well done, it's not just like... I, I mean, like, your typical traditional horror movies, I'm just not a fan of. They just don't do anything yeah. for me. Uh, and I think most people that uh, see shit in real life. Yeah. Like, just, when you see the shit in real life and then you see it in camera, it's like, I don't know, it just doesn't seem real or... No, no. <laughs> oh, let him go straight back! Yeah. Ooh, you bugger with a pistol. Life is awesome. What are you playing and is it free to download? It is called Battlefield 1 and it's about £16 on PC or console. Is it, if you look at CD keys, uh, Life is awesome, you might be able to find it a bit cheaper. The reason I laugh is because... Um, so he um, sort of Maybe I'm wrong. What? Why don't I just turn it up a little bit more, Pickles? There we go. Oh, so what did you say about making it free? Yeah. I also heard that the next battlefield is going to be the last battlefield, which I don't, I don't know whether that's true or not. I hope it's not. Hmm. I I I seen this today that they've said they're not doing any more updates after season seven. Yeah. Of, uh, battlefield. No more yeah. live live. Uh, I saw that. I don't mind that so much. You, you know. But as long as I was like, I think it's myself. But I really don't. They don't stop doing battlefield. So like, battlefield still got a lot of halfway there. Fine game and yeah. stuff. So, yeah. Mm. I, I always knew there was a possibility that they were going to turn around and call time on it, but yeah, I don't know. A world without battlefield is a sad and lonely place. <laughs> I don't think it's worth too much. It's like Battlefront and and COD. They're never going to every every couple of years. You're always always going to be that's called cool due to they're they're never going to stop pumping that game. <laughs> I subscribe to you. I'm from Alaska. Oh, nice oh, one. Nice. Life is Alaska. awesome. Nice. nice. That's a place I'd like to go, actually. Oh, behind me. Oh, I'm in the queue. That's why I'm still in the latest group. I was wondering. <laughs> oh, yeah. You know I really do miss the, the music from this game. Oh yeah, I, I was saying this. I might do a video actually at some point when I have some time. It's it's. Well, I I find with older games the music's just a lot better. Yeah, it is because they were still spending money and it was being mm. done by human beings. Whereas nowadays, I just imagine it's probably just being done by robots or just yeah. outsourced to cheap, cheaper places. Yeah, cheap cheap as possible. Cheap and cheerful. Oh, God, I, I'm so uh, yeah. God, I'm, I'm so glad I didn't put any money into uh, what was it Battlefield 2042? Mm. Mm. The point is, I already got scarred by Battlefield 5 because I bought I bought that full price and then about like not even like two or three years of just like yeah we're pulling development on it. Uh, so you you built you built a game you've not even completed it. Yeah. That's that's the way they are nowadays. Though it's, uh, yeah. they literally just making money off the back of the name of the franchise mm. now. Yeah. Battlefield One was probably the last one. We've said this every time, haven't we? Battlefield One yeah. was probably the last. Oh yeah. Oh, nice one. You're in my squad as well. I, th I think they will attempt to do another. 
I think the problem is, give it a bit of time, you always get this, like, they yeah. come out with, like, three, four really bad games, and then... Well, I mean, Battlefield tends to go good game, bad game, in my experience. Yeah. You know, service quite. What, what uh, game are we playing? Uh, a team deathmatch at the minute. Nice one. I find, it, I, I find it better because when you're playing Team Deathmatch, you actually do find out your proper skill. Uh, yeah, yeah. Where, when you're playing on the bigger maps, you just sort of get steamrolled by that one artillery guy or that one git at the back in a tank. <laughs> Here's somebody. Game like scored. All right, you're alive. Oh, are you still going live on a kick? Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. An amazing platform, mate. Mm. I, I'd honestly, I know I say this like every time I see, you, but like restream <laughs> to both platforms. Mm. Kick is such an amazing platform for growing your plat for growing your community. Yeah. Um, your brand. I might, as I, I keep looking at it, I, I can't seem to get my uh, it, it, the stream key don't work for me for some strange reason. What the fuck, Pickles? What happened? Oh, I just died. I just fucking shot at the guy three times. He was really close <laughs> to me and I missed him every time. I'm just embarrassed. I don't think I can come back from that. <laughs> Mm. I, was, I, I stopped playing this game for about two weeks. I came back and yes, there was my so I choose there was my first stream back after two weeks, and I was just doing some weird, weird stuff. I'm walking out in the middle of the, like literally seeing the bullets flying down range, and I'm walking out in the middle of the road, catching every single one. I, one game I've been me and Dave and uh, them lot have been playing is uh, Lethal Company. Okay, yeah, yeah. A few, few mm. people um, that I know have been getting into that. What's up, gameplay? That, that a, that's a beautiful game. Yeah. Hello, gameplay. How are you doing? Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Yep. Oh, that's what I meant to do. Awesome. Here all day, Cyanide. What's up, homie? Thank you so much for stopping by saying hi, my friend. I've literally just got up. Uh, I just realized I did eight hours yesterday. Crazy, right? <laughs> what, eight hours? Uh... Eight hour stream What's yesterday. Doing? Ouch. Yeah. It's it's hell hell divers, man. It's a very addictive game. It, it gets you oh, I keep, I keep trying to convince Solana and uh Dave uh, sorry, uh, Dave to start playing it, but uh I thought you were the, not... you were the one that was gonna need convincing. Why have you got it? Oh no no, I I am I I was sitting there going like I wanna play it. Yeah. We we keep my my like sort of friends group are sort of going like, Oh, we need a game to play together. Uh, so we started playing. Um, if you can, uh, lethal company, if you can convince um, them into hell divers, it's not what mm. kind of game that you're used to because obviously you like your historic base games, which I 100 percent mm. get. Um, but it's it's the complete opposite of that. <laughs> it's it's so good. It's so good. It's, it's the graphics on it are amazing. Yeah, I've seen a lot. Of, I've seen some. I think it's you and Two Point playing it. Um. And that, it does look really good. And you know what? You, the reason you can tell, uh, like, one of the ways you can tell it's actually still good is, that, like, even though it was super popular when it first came out, it hasn't dropped off the yet. And mm. it's been, like, two months since it came out. Yeah. Maybe longer. So, to uh, me, it, look, know, it looks a bit it's like... That's a long time for a game to do well. Yeah. It's still attracting millions of players. Hmm. Oh, wow, I'm terrible at this game. Our side have struck first. I've, I've, I've seen a lot about it and going like, oh, I, I really want to start probably getting into that. Um, but it's, it's convincing the others to do it. it to be honest, it reminds me a little bit like uh, like Destiny, if you ever played that game. I remember that. Yeah, I mean, so I did play Destiny the first one a little bit. I didn't go too deep mm. onto it, into it, but yeah, it was... Mm. Um, 
It's it is similar. It is similar to Destiny. I have to admit, it's not loot shooter or like you know you're not like going after loot so much. Yeah. And what I find really cool about it is basically that it's one universe and everyone, like the whole community, like works together to get um, what they're called. They called the major orders. So, mm. There's always like there's just one persistent campaign going on, and everyone fights together. Like yeah, even though you're in four man teams, like you're all like you're all like I don't know. It's hard to describe, but basically there's loads of different teams. Yeah. Uh, one big universe. Uh, first day. I miss every shot then. First stayed up there if you need it, mate. Yeah, nice one. I'm gonna go up and above. Oh, oh wow, this isn't going well for me. That's yeah, fine. I'll probably try and stick around you then. You gone up? Yeah, on on the castle uh, ramparts now, mate. Yeah, nice one. I'm going up. Covering you. First aid, nice one. There we go. You know, I've been uh, getting really. I mean, getting back into all those old World War II sort of films with David Niven in it and stuff like that. Oh, Some yeah. Great films. I need to send you a link, mm. actually. To, I'll get you, mate. Oh. I know it was. Oh, what is it? I, I've watched twice now. Um, Bridge Too Far. They know we're here. Yeah, such a yeah. good Oh, that's a mortar oh. mate. Get off here. Um, yeah, nice one. Such a good film. And he's like, he wants to surrender. Oh dear. Tell him we haven't got the capacity to accept prisoners. <laughs> I'm sorry, we can't accept you all as prisoners. <laughs> I, I, I like it because I, re I really like it because it's a British movie yeah. um, done with proper British humour. It's like, no, it annoys yeah. me when you see, uh, <clears throat> oh, was it like British, uh, not British, uh, Band of Brothers? Where they're like, they make out the British to be like, oh, we've got to do it by the rules and everything. Yeah, and like, yeah. I can't shoot him if I can't bloody see him. Yeah. It's like, we, yeah. we don't talk like that. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Leave it to the Americans to fuck up the British accent. I have yeah. this conversation so often with the other pigs. So I'm just like, guys, I hate, I hate to say it, but like, find me one example of an American actor that genuinely That's does a good boy. British accent. I can't think yeah. of any. I can't think of even one example. Maybe there is like two, but I just can't think of them. That's not to say there isn't yeah. any American actors that can't do a good British accent, but I will find you mm. fucking a lot of examples of British <laughs> actors that do amazing American accents. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. It's like, was it? I'm watching the. Uh, we've been watching <laughs> Spider Man and stuff like the new ones. Yeah. And I, I, it took me ages to realise that the actual actor, I think it's named mm. Holland, Tom Holland, oh, yeah. is actually like British. Like and I'm like, what? I don't know if it's Birmingham, but like, yeah, he's he's he's British. Yeah, I think he's like actually thinking about. It, he's probably more southern than that. He's, mm. he's got more of a neutral accent. But yeah, I mean, like Scottish people do American do American accents really well. Hmm. Yeah. Same with, um, I didn't realise, we watched uh, Oppenheimer a couple of months ago. I haven't watched it yet, but... Um, oh, again, it's brilliant. Ray Murphy. Mm. I mean, yeah, I don't yeah, know yeah. what Oppenheimer Irish. even was. Um, I don't think Oppenheimer was American originally. I think he was like from... What was he from? I think, no, I think it was English, actually. Was he English? Well, I remember... I think, yeah, it was English that went to... A well, name like Oppenheimer, I'm guessing no. there was some Germanic descendancy in there, I'd imagine. Sounds Germanic. Yeah, he was, he was, um, he was German. I think, I think it was half German, something like that. I can't quite remember 100% now. I think he actually was American. He went to Britain and then he went like, to Germany for a couple of years. I similar situation to like Einstein. Like Einstein was yeah. to be made to leave Germany because he was Jewish in like the 1920s mm. or under 30s. I can't remember which. So I'm just wondering yeah, whether it's similar to like, like yeah. Oppenheimer's family or maybe like even Russian maybe, to be fair, because um, mm. there was a lot of um, Oppenheimer, Heimer, Heimer. I want to say that's more mm. German, almost definitely, almost definitely kind of Bavarian. Mm. used to be good at this game, I promise. <laughs> I was saying, it took me a couple of days to get back into it. You still play much Battlefield 5? 
Uh, I, to be honest, whilst I was off, I did play some Battlefield 5 because they've just launched the uh, anti-cheat now. Oh, really? Oh, right. Okay. Yeah. Like, really? Yeah, which, to be honest, I, I was playing it sort of go, oh, I, I'm going to play it and try and catch like, the last few hackers. Um, the only reason we stopped then, playing it, dude, we should go back to that. Yeah. Well, it's still quite... I think I've got to get back into it. It's still difficult to play for me, but I was about for five and about for it's, one take. It's the... Game. Yeah, it's the um, TTK for me. Yeah. The Whatever it is. The, um, the amount of rounds that you've got to put into someone is ridiculous. So just mm. take them down. <clears throat> <clears throat> Watch out, left, left flank, mate. Left, okay. Towards, yeah. Towards the north, sorry, southwest. Use that first leg. I'm gonna close this door. I wanna, I also, I was a two pint keeps talking to me about getting a uh, hell at loose. I've um, got it, I just, I, I just don't have anything to play it. with, so I've got I leave it. it. Um, I think I've still got it installed as well. I don't think I understand. Because mm. it is a good one, I have to admit. Um, and it's got a lot better. Um, yeah. And it's a really good, strong game, that. Mm. That's it. The way ahead. That was the film the I was watching ahead. the other day, and it's, it's it came out in 1944. That's how old it is. Oh, it's like and it's in black and white, but then they've mm. done the whole like colorized it. You know, what's it called? The, oh yeah, yeah. Where they use that color um, shading, and it doesn't make a difference. Yeah, what one is? Uh, have you seen? Um, oh, I believe, what's that, what's that movie called? All oh, Quiet on the Western Front. Yeah, the original. Oh, the original and the new one. I think the original's the, better. I yeah, I've seen I've one, seen parts of the original. The new one just didn't. Uh, I don't know. I think they should have stuck to the book. Like, the, the, the, have you ever read the book? The book's amazing. I don't. I can't read. <laughs> well, audio, my friend, audible. Oh, yeah, yeah, in true. In the same boat. True. In the same the, the boat. Mod the modern age. Audible. I've had audible since 2015, I want to say, and I've listened to just under four and a half months worth of audio books. The majority of those are about World War Two. <laughs> oh, you a, a lot of it. Oh, won it? You died, won it? Hold on. But yeah, Where's your kit? really worth getting, dude. Like, oh, damn it. You'd love it mm. as well, because there's so many good books out there that are mm. like, yeah, I'm the same, dude. Dyslexia really makes it, like, those long books a struggle. But you turn on yeah. an audio book whilst you're driving and whilst you're falling asleep. Mm. That, that's Is that, I, I, I, I think the other, the other problem with me, because I, I, I've, I've, I've got dyslexia, but there's obviously it's a few other things as well. I'm more of, like, more visual. Yeah. Like, I've got to physically see it. And everything. Even I, the books I bought for the reenactment, yeah. I, I, I, I actually, like they're actually pictures and everything. There's pictures in everything. I, I, I like it when I can physically hold it, and then I can sort of go like, I understand a lot more about it. That's why YouTube is um, mm. another one that I use quite a lot because you've got some really good YouTube channels out there that make some very good visual presentations. Yeah. Fuck's sake, why have I still got the DMR version of this goddamn sweeper? <laughs> oh, you ain't got the automatic? No, oh, I this... keep meaning to put it on. I keep failing to. I don't oh, think I got a single kill there, you know. Oh, sink right in Scar. Scar, Scar, Scar. Yeah. Yeah, go on then. Scar. If, um, I, I know I was like that yesterday. I, pl I played a few games. I was just like, I think I started. What was it? I think I did like. I think just, I did something like. Four to twelve or something silly. I'm like, nah, I shouldn't be like this. And then I played a bit and then got better. Same thing with Battlefield Five. I played that. I did really bad. And then I think I played some team deathmatch and ended up finishing something like twenty-four to three. We lose that one. We're the Ottomans. Um, yeah. I mean, I, the Ottomans like, won Gallipoli, we... but they still lost the war. Sucks to be them. Yeah, well, it's. I think they had. A f I think it's all. All, all the things is. Uh, I know the Glippley campaign was a complete failure, but at the same time, sort of going well. We were last man standing. 
they still had to. They, they it, it, not only not only they lost the war, but the whole empire just collapsed. Yeah. So I'm like, uh, is it really a victory? Did they really win? I mean, it's like Austria, like Austria and uh, Ottoman Empire, two empires that fell off the back of uh, World War One. Crazy. Mm. Austria was like a long one as well. I don't mean about. Use that first aid. I think it's, yeah, I think wasn't it the second biggest in Europe or something like that. It's it's something silly. Tom Pickles actually. But well, Austria is actually more do especially before, before the First World War. Uh, Austria was supposed to be like the most dominant actual force in Europe. Benny, Benny. And then they just, just, just it failed. Oh Benny, oh, Benny, Benny, Benny. He's to the right. There's two of them. There's lots of them. You suck on my grenades. <laughs> See, because I've been playing so much Hell Divers, every time someone, one of my teammates dies, I'm like, oh, I need to call you in. Yeah. Well, safely, I was, I was doing that because I've got to be playing um, Lethal Company. The sprint button's like the, um, I was at the uh, left bumper. Like, I just kept pressing that. Yeah. And I was still going like, oh, bloody hell, I'm not doing that again. Oh, I'm on your six. After this, can we go to operations? Because I am... Um... Shit, yeah, yeah, we <laughs> Yeah, no worries. Yeah, we're trying operation. This is where I need to be though, getting practice. Oh, I got killed. Yay. Watch out, grenade going down range. Yeah. Oh, well. gas, gas, gas. What's the gas button? Fuck. Uh, up. Up. Oh, I play oh, on mouse fuck. and keyboard. Oh, shit. Yeah, uh, T. Yeah, it's T. Someone in that building. Got him. Ooh. Scary moment. Fumbling with my gas mask. <laughs> Cliche World War they, they are not. It's. I'll have to do a video at some point on how to put on a gas mask because I've got a few. What, in real life? <laughs> yeah, I got re I've got an original ones and stuff. You can't actually. You no, know when you're in game, you just sort of put them on your face. You can't. You've got to take your helmet off, but you oh, can't just take your helmet off. You've got to take off. You got. You got to take off. You got to sort of slide your helmet back. Oh, they're downstairs. Yeah, sorry to interrupt you. I'm sure I have yeah, no footsteps. No, no, no, no. It was a mine, mate. Right? You gotta sort of slide your helmet back. Oh, you're right, yeah, you're right. Yeah, you gotta slide your helmet back so you, your chin strap is around your neck and the helmet's at the back of your head. Put your gas mask on and slide your helmet over the top. It's like the most awkward thing to try and do. Oh, gas, gas, gas. The enemy is in the lead. Oh, damn it. Got shot. What was that? Big smokers. Bad for one. Bad for one, yep. Enemy team oh, Battlefield. Oh, bad for one. Best one yet. Definitely. Yeah, definitely one of the strongest. Mm. I think that and Battlefield 3. Hmm. I know, I know, to be honest, I, I'm, I've never played Battlefield. Oh, yeah. Like, everyone loved I've, 4, um, but 4, they repeated 3 too much whilst taking away the cool features that made 4 work, sorry, yeah. 3 work so well. Oh, fuck. When you go back and play 3 now, you just realise why it was such a good game. Like, even the soldier movement feels like it's moving, you know, it's like slow like it would be in real life. Mm, yeah. Well, I remember when I played this originally, because when, like, in Battlefield 1, you jump over walls, you sit there and go, like, oh, why is he jumping so slow? I, I came for, like, games like um, Assassin's Creed and stuff like that when I was growing up. So then playing a game like this and it's everything slow, I'm like, why am I moving so slow? Jump over the wall! And now I do reenactments, I find that, like, even, like, getting out of a vehicle yeah, is just sort of like, like, nope, you ain't doing that. <laughs> that ain't a quick yeah. thing. You were carrying all this gear and... Mm. Even this game feels like very glidy. Yeah. Oh, so I'm, I'm about. Got him. I'm about 11 stone. If I put on all my kit, I at least. At least is like another level, like probably 10 Just stone on me. my body. Nice one. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's a lot of weight. Yeah. Mm. A lot of weight. Even the clothing see why, wouldn't have mm. been made back then. It, you know, it would have been so cumbersome and just the fabric and. Ammunition for yeah, you. It's thick. Oh, the, the uniform. It's thick. Yeah. Proper thick uniform. 
Hundred percent wool as well, and it's not even like like when the people say hundred percent wool, they think like suits because a lot of them are wool. Uh, but no, it's it's like a proper wiry wool. It's like no like Jack Russells. They got like that really wiry like. I got that guy. Fur. It's like that being rubbed against you all the time. Spawn back on me. Yeah, nice one. Oh fuck, they're on a six as well. Where about so here? Yeah. Oh yeah, I see ya. Somewhere to by that building on a six. To the east. Yeah, gas. Do that one. Take the ammo. I think they've all gone away. Yeah, from this immediate area. Ah, head. Grenade. I'm keeping an eye on that window. Yeah, nice one. I'm gonna throw a gas grenade. Yeah, he's up. upstairs. That's why you keep an eye on the window. And there's still a guy in that gateway. Not anymore. Yeah, nice you got one. me though. I'm moving up. Okay, no worries. I got the two piece. <laughs> Throwing a bomb there. No medics? Oh, that's a shame. Let's go just heroically uh, save everyone. Halfway there. We need to push I don't know why, but on PC, like, people don't seem to, like... Be medic. <laughs> like, yeah, be medics. All support. People are built differently these days. Ooh, and they haven't... Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Like, I don't even know if it's a PC console divide or whether it's it's just something that is more cultural these days. Like a modern but, thing, yeah. yeah. And, like, and also they really need to put the, like, the very clear emphasis back on... Um, team uh, play. Back on team play, yeah. On, and they yeah. really... It's like, so Battlefield 2042, for example. Um, you know, it's really, they blurred the lines on, like, the whole kit system and the traditional Battlefield squad system. They've gone after some weird hybrid of features from different games, which for some reason yeah. the guys dads love to do, which I fucking hate. Um, it's, I, I'm just in the motion of, like, the lines, if it's not broke, don't fix it. Yeah, if, if it's not broke, don't fix mm. it. So why are you trying to do it? They've got integrity. They don't trust their own products. Like, it, yeah. You know, like Battlefields is tried and tested. Like the reason people love Battlefield because it's different to other games and it's got its own unique personality yeah. and characteristics, which they've systematically watered down since Battlefield 4 mm. to uh, try and make the game more appeasing to a wider game base to sell more. Products. Yeah. So, I, I mean, same. I can see. I can see why they're doing <laughs> it. Yeah, it's like someone was saying to me a while ago, like, why do you like playing Battlefield One over like other games like Call of Duty and stuff? And I just said that it's it's one of these games where it's also, it's fun and it's entertaining at the same time. You don't have to be a skill player. And you don't have to yeah. be like you don't have to sweat your like, your, your yeah, bollocks off sweaty. to actually like, do something. You know, it's yeah, massive. it's like not just beyond just going around right, killing mm. people. You, know, you can do a lot. Yeah. But I find like now a lot of a lot of games nowadays are very uh Well that's the beauty like, of Hell Divers actually, it's like mm. um you've gotta really balance your kits in that. Like, you know, it's like you've got it in some actual thought beyond Oh, I just got burnt to death. Um there's some Aww. actual thought process put into it beyond just, you know, um point your gun and shoot. Because that is the most like yeah boring shit ever. Like, you know, you can do that in game ever. Yeah. Um Whereas I want a little bit of like, you know, action. Then I guess, but that's why Hell at least, you know, it's an intelligent game. You've got to think about what you're doing. Um, yeah. There's other aspects to it, you know, pointing and shooting, you know, build and gather, gather, not so much gather resources, but you know, you can get. Oh, fuck. There's another level to it. It's not just run around and shoot. Uh, yeah, shoot bullets and, yeah. Linear. I wish there's a bit more thinking in Battlefield One. At the yeah, same time, yeah. it, the problem is it, when you start adding stuff like that, a skilled player just starts falling on their arse. Yeah, this is the problem because it's it, like it really is like I mean, Battlefield initially had quite a like like a hardcore player base in terms of mm. like the, the gameplay style, um, and over the years it's become more casual and more and more of a casual game as they again. Down, added features from other games, you know, their marketing, 
you know, games just become more successful, main, more mainstream. So the community, yeah. as a result, of that's become more casual. What's up, Frankie? How are you doing today, sir? Hope you're having a fantastic day, my friend. Thank you so much for stopping by. Oh, you're back out. And... Sorry, you want to go back out and do uh, and operations? Yeah, if that's cool. Yeah, yeah, we could do that. <clears throat> we need to join up in the same squad as well, properly. Yeah. Oh, you're not in my squad? I thought you were in my squad. I, well, I, w I thought so, but when I looked at it there, I wasn't. I think, like, you've got a, like, party, that's it. Party and squad are different. Ah, fair know. enough. Oh, yeah, we're yeah, in the same one. Like, party. Like, quits. There you go. Yeah. Ah, yeah, fair enough. Good, thanks. How's Battlefield? I haven't played uh, that long. Honestly, dude, it's refreshing just to come back and play a little bit of Battlefield uh, 1 occasionally, you know, just mm. to change it up. My boy, uh, Benny, plays this shit, like, all the time. He loves this. He's, uh, like, really mm. dedicated to it, so it gives me a good opportunity just to come back and play it and enjoy it. Um, just a heads up, Frankie, I've just followed your Twitter, and I clicked on your embedded YouTube link, and it doesn't appear to work, my friend. So not too sure what you've got that um, set up as, it, um, but basically you just need the numbers at the end of the link. You don't need the entire link, because otherwise it'll just fuck up the link. <laughs> but yeah, got you on Twitter now, Bremer. Uh, come join us sometime, dude. It'd be uh, you know if you uh, if sounds like you, you you know looking for any kind of battlefield crew. We do play about a lot of battlefield twenty forty two. We play all the battlefields really. Battlefield five, this one, battlefield three. Mm. Um, but we also been smashing oh, yeah, a lot of our players hit cards and hell divers. You know all the contemporary games really. So if you're free to play with, then check out the Warpigs Discord, my friends. Link comes up in the in the chat uh, occasionally, and it's also in the channel description down below. A narrow waterway leading to the Turkish capital. Oh yeah, no wounded man. Especially if it's like an intermittent thing, you know, if it's broken, broken, you know how to fix that. But I sent you a invite there to the party. With dawn. I see that wish fulfilled. Thousands of us wait quietly in the hull of this old collier ship. A Trojan horse, ready for the Ottomans with our sharpened British steel. Benny. I saw the maps that the commanders are using. They're from the oh, you got hell divers. Oh, dude, you should definitely join us then. Like, we are like a hell diving community. We dive daily. Like, uh, yeah. <laughs> I had that game since about a week after it came out, and. Oh, he's, I think I'm coming up to 100. Soldiers, today we hours. seize the beating so, yeah, of the very Ottoman addicting. Empire. Very we addictive seize game. Gallipoli. At dawn, we storm V Beach at Cape Ellis. From there, we take their force. That's I'm just back now. Because... Oh, sweet no, dude. Um, I just start up. I'm sending you an invite. And take their coastal batteries at Morton. Oh, no, I'm actually in a game at the minute on operations. So I'll probably send you a. Let me join. See, is it gonna put us in the area? Let's see. There we go. Ah, nice. That party invite as well. This is very good. Uh, I think that's just yeah. Because you've got to do a game and party invite. Oh no, you haven't a party yet. There we go. Let's join. Let's join Freddy. Hmm. Oh wow, they are destroying the boats really quickly. Okay, I might use smoke. No, they're not going to play nice, Pickles. I'm telling you now. <laughs> Why is it just keep doing that? There we go. Return to the combat area. Return to the combat area. 
I think if I remember, you can actually go up the left here. There we go. Return to the combat area. I think you. I think from what I remember, you come up here. But maybe not. Oh, bugger. Hmm. Maybe Morton Smoke? Return to the combat area. I don't know where you're going, mate. Oh my god, okay. I don't think we're going to be able to get up this beach. Sorry, Benny, I was just talking to the stream. Look, ah, you know it. Literally. Here we fucking go. It's, uh, they're, they're putting up a lot of resistance. I can't even go onto the beach. <laughs> oh, the, the British, we're attacking, we're going to get fucked up. I'm sure this it's will go well. Be. Churchill designed this plan himself, we'll be fine. <laughs> Alright, this is going to be fucking nuts, boys. This is World War One's D Day. Fucking. Fucking dog sector. You know, to the sure. combat area. <laughs> I love it, we haven't even fucking made like any progress whatsoever. Oh yeah, no spawn beacons Oh yeah, nothing like that. No, you fancy you fancy fancy stuff here. Alright, I'm just taking in a good old Iron Sights the M field. That's all I need. Third person in this, isn't it? There we go. Uh, already getting fucked up. Jesus. Mm -hmm. Fucking. The fences they got on the beach. I'm not out of the combat area in the day. <laughs> Yet. Well, I am. Uh, massively. Alright. Oh! Took a fucking panic there, though. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, shit. I gotta go. Machine gun sighted. Oh, that was I'm, I'm right at their spawn at the minute. That was horrible. Right, I'm spawning in on you, mate. One sec. Yeah, keep your head down. A little bit of damage to some dude, and that's it. Oh my god, you really are in it, aren't you? Oh, yeah. Hell, first things first, let's get a flare up. Oh, let's not set myself on fire. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, we're in some rando squad here, so. At the nearest convenience, I think we should set up our own squad. Yeah. Alright, I'm dying. I'm gonna do that now. Um. Oh, we'll say, we, we, uh, I can get control in a minute. If he, uh, if our boy dies, I'll be able to take the squad. Sounds so atitious. I like it. Oh, I, do, I got so many kills then. <laughs> oh. oh, that's better. I can actually see now. Gone. This boat's got bollocks. Yeah. All right, we've made landfall oh, yeah. on a little spit of the rock. I've found some smoke up. Some dude to the right. Jesus. There's no surviving this. Like so many snipers looking at us right now. Yeah, I've got, I've got some smoke. We should more. Pop it they should have given us like more artillery. Um, more. Naval artillery, that's for sure. Like, I'm sure the, I'm sure the yeah. British went in with some naval artillery. Oh, oh, just look, look oh. at all the boats. Be oh, we got a dreadnought actually. I've just seen that giant dreadnought behind us. Yeah, like. Oh, there you go. That's what I'm talking about. Like, that's what I mean. There we go. Literally. 
Jesus, they're not even Take letting us on the beach. Fair enough. They are trying to invade their homeland. No, it's no, all British land. Empire. No, this is this is like actually full on Ottoman Empire home invasion. Not home invasion, but demigod. What's up, Amy? I'm not having to make Oh, bugger! Hitting that battlefield one with my boy Bennett. We're having a good old time of it. Thank you, my friend. Mm. Well, except oh. we keep dying <laughs> on the shores of Gallipoli. I'm sure there's a poem in there about it somewhere. Mm. Oh, yeah, there's definitely got to be something. The blood spilled deep into the waves. Oh, wow, we just got smashed. Our invasion has failed. We have been like rats caught in a trap in this foreign land. I pray for an end to this I'll be war lost. Oops. and to see our homes once again. Yep. The Allies withdrew from the Gallipoli Peninsula in January 1916. GG, Scott, GG. six months of continuous fighting, the Allies had lost over 44,000 men and the Turkish twice that number. No ground was gained at all by the British. While the campaign did divert large Turkish forces away from the Russians, it was a military oh, so peace himself here. unifying <laughs> motivating the Ottomans instead of defeating them. Winston Churchill was demoted and then resigned from the cabinet. Colonel Mustafa Kemal became the people's hero and was later to become the founding father of the Turkish Republic. I just put bloody Churchill, that's his career over. <laughs> we don't hear any more about him, that's for sure. That's all just came back. Yeah, he's done in the political world for sure. <laughs> I just wanted to put there's no comeback if I'm that. <laughs> <laughs> I love a little bit of history banter. That's it. Like Battlefield 1, the banter's so much more like just history based. <laughs> oh my God, I got well, zero. That's what I like about there. it. It's, it's just so much more historically. Yeah, at this point, so if you're saying playing Battlefield mm -hmm. 1, it's because you like your history. Mm. It's one thing the Norse would say that it's, they miss a big opportunity in Battlefield Five, and the, the, I know they kept saying about the wanting to educate people, but the, there's just no education no, in that game no, at all. No, they they fucked up so much. So that was what made this game beautiful. It was rich with detail, and it was true mm. to the actual situation, and told a, a coherent story. And like Battlefield Five, just they, they really just went down some real fucking rabbit hole there. Mm. Yeah. If I if I was the developer on Battlefield Five, I'd have just done it. Ba I'd done it a five year like yeah. basis and just followed it, basic how the war went. Yeah, that's it. Keep it simple. Keep it simple. Stupid. Tell them you know, mm. start exactly start out. You know how fucking excited people would have been like those certain waypoints, like you know Pearl Harbor in the Pacific. And like mm. you know, like all the crazy shit, and like I don't include the Nice in the front. There is just yeah, literally, point, yeah, complete a fight just, to just criminal, like criminal. <clears throat> How you know? I'm I'm not surprised Putin felt fucking pissed. You know, it almost justifies <laughs> Ukraine. It almost, almost, almost. <laughs> he just thought. He just woke up one day and just went, ah, it's just like, they didn't include us in Battlefield 5. Oh, I want my right. own Battlefield oh, game. Right, right, right. We're going to make a battle Russian battle. And it'll be the best Battlefield game ever. <laughs> oh, bugger. Fuck me. With this team we're playing against, the, the, the, yeah, we're fucked. <laughs> They're good. Mm. All right, back to 
I'm gonna try and go big machine gun. Yeah, I think. Oh, oh wow, got bombed and everything. They're knocking us back here, buddy. I mean, that's some Russian protocol. Not, no, not one step back! Some bloody squad here. Forgot about that. <laughs> oh, well. Yeah, I, I just called for. Yeah, he's dead now. Um, oh, there we go. I'm, I'm team leader. Um, I'm now the captain. Fuck. Stay to Al for a sake. Is fuck. Yeah, no, it's one. I'm gonna get up and balls. set up in on the rooftop up here and get sniped immediately. What? Yeah. Oh wow, that horse! I got a few shots on him there. Mm. Oh, I've got quite a nice view because the sight in the moon. Mm. Might spawn in you and give some ammo. Did that horse go down? Oh, magazine change. Oh, uh, oh! Tank. fuck! They forget where I'm at. <laughs> they put a mortar there. Oh shit! Yeah. yeah. They know exactly where we oh, are. I just wanted to stay there for like five minutes and oh, I was putting down such a good field of fire. We have lost objective apples. I think I'm, I think I'm gonna go assault and just start putting down some we have mines. Lost the sector. Jeez, okay, we're being steamrolled. I have a tank to our right side of the actual A point. The enemy has reached the final objective. Oh, bloody hell, they just cut through us that quickly. Yeah, they're, they're, going, they're going in. They got a tank on eight. Mm. I think this is probably playing out. Got... This is like literally yeah. history playing out now. Okay. When you got a good strong team like that, though. Lawrence of Arabia has kicked in. <laughs> Fucking wanker! Have they get you? Yo, what's up, sir? State, how you doing, my friend? How are we? Hope you're doing well. Uh, Ooh. Oh, we that, lost. Like one, my friend, the British, let me give you a little shout out there. Half mm. the world have taken these custom. lands from us, but this curse is also a blessing. For now, we can join our brothers to attack the Suez Canal. Some time after the British secured the oil fields in the Persian Gulf, the Ottomans launched an audacious attack on the Suez Canal, <laughs> the key to maintaining British wow. dominance in the world. That was, that was quick. How long was that operation? Five minutes? Eight minutes? Um, it was quick. It felt quick. It felt quick and it felt violating. Yeah. Sevgili abicim, dün Süveyş kanalına bir taarruzda bulundu. İngiliz İmparatorluğu'nun bu damarını Onların taarruzunu beklemeliyiz. Emperyal canavar henüz uyanmadı. Buralar çölü geçebileceğimizi ihtimal Yarın inşallah bu aptallıkları yüzünden... Should Kantara fall, we will retreat to our rear artillery position on Hill 50 and defend it to the last man. 
As long as our guns can remain on that hill, we will grind the British down and force them to abandon the canal. I'm spending some mines out. I want a, I want a horse to run straight into one. Oh, fuck my life. Whose idea was it to do operations? <laughs> yeah. No, I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> My stream really ain't doing very well tonight. Yeah, it's the old uh, peaks and troughs, isn't it? Hmm. <clears throat> It's a kick, man. What's that? Kick. A platform. Just oh, yeah. <coughs> just either start doing like alternating noise. Or, um, or restream it. Hmm. To both. Actually, I wonder if I can I'm do the main live way. stream. <coughs> Ooh, you bugger. Grenade. What if I, I wonder, oh, I might try to sneak after this stream, uh, doing an actual live stream, but do it through primary kick and then do a secondary. And see if that works. No, I don't know what you meant, sorry. Um, so I sort of try to do the, uh, instead of making YouTube the primary, make the kick the primary, and the yeah. YouTube the secondary, well, and see if that actually works. Oh uh, yeah, OBS. So Kick doesn't have a great history of working very well with OBS. Um, so my advice would be uh, move move over to Trojan Streamlabs. It's a really streamlined process. Um, you literally can import everything from your settings and all your um, scenes from OBS into mm. Streamlabs because it's the same. I don't know. It's it's the, basically the same platform you. Need. Uh, my experience is easier to use. I've been using Streamlabs since Move Kick about seven months ago. Mm, it's definitely yeah. easier. But honestly, with Kick, it's it's just genuinely a good place to like meet up people 